flying sharks that chase their victims, mutant predators that surprise fishermen and bathers, demonic creatures that were worshipped in ancient civilizations. These are the four mythological sharks that are scarier than the megalodon. Number 4. Flying Sharks Our first stop takes us to the Philippines, although it would be inaccurate to say this. It actually takes us to the translations of certain mythologies of its history, which describe a creepy and monstrous creature, very similar to the shark we all know, but with big differences. According to the ancient epics of the Ibelon, one of the books that compiles the traditions and legends that constitute the essence of the people of the Philippines, a warrior hero named Han Diong managed to confront monstrous creatures called Triburon, which possessed large wings, an extremely resistant skin and saw-like teeth that could crush rocks. The Philippine natives recognized this creature by the name of Pating Na Pakpan, and according to tradition, these beasts lasted almost an eternity tormenting people. Nothing could oppose them, not even the caves of the rudimentary houses built in the past. The most chilling thing was the flying ability of this monstrous shark. There was no one who could escape its insatiable and bloodthirsty appetite. Fortunately, Han Diong managed to confront this beast and is even said to have tamed it, bringing its monstrous regime of horror to an end. Number 3. Mutant Predators For all living beings, sharks are already terrifying enough as we know them with their robust bodies, monstrous jaws and thirst for blood, without adding elements that make them even more dangerous and chilling. However, there's one creature that can surpass the fame of any other relative of its species, and that includes the Megalodon. This is the Lascaux Shark a sea monster that has been described as a half-shark, half-octopus beast. At first, it may sound amusing to imagine this powerful killing machine with a body that combines the physiognomy of an octopus. After all, sharks are coarse and brutal while invertebrates appear much softer and flimsier. However, the joy can fade in a matter of seconds, especially when we explore Bahamian mythology which points to the Lascaux as the main culprit responsible for sinking ships and devouring their crews. According to local accounts, the Lascaux never left any survivors. Its destructive capacity was such that it could even control the temperaments of the ocean, causing destructive vortexes, gigantic whirlpools, and even blue holes from which no one could escape. Such fury was worthy of terror and suspicion. So the native inhabitants tried to honor these creatures and avoid it at all costs. For far from being a harmless monster, it was one of the greatest tragedies fishermen and sailors could come across. Number 2. The Demon of the Ocean The next creature on the list comes from Greek mythology, and that can only mean three things. Death, chaos, and destruction. According to the oral account, there was a demigod who was more like a demon than a human. His name was Achilles, and most texts describe him as a hybrid between man and shark. Son of Zeus and Lamia, many accounts describe him as a beautiful creature with a pride that caused his own ruin, as he boasted that his beauty surpassed that of Aphrodite herself. The punishment for such a claim was to turn him into a demonic and deformed beast that tormented the oceans and men. Achilles suffered a condemnation that not only made him endure permanent ugliness, but also pushed him to connect with his baser instincts. Bloodlust and vengeance took over his senses. His only thoughts revolved around murder, and some of the most horrific maritime massacres in Greek history are attributed to him. Achilles would emerge from the depths of the ocean and leave rivers of blood staining the waters. Corpses were never seen again. Some believe that he devoured his victims and collect their bones in his marine lair. Others are convinced that this beast tortured men, seducing them with all sorts of tricks until they were trapped by his jaws, which were huge and full of teeth so powerful that they could easily crush even the sturdiest warship of the time. Number 1. The Shark God 
In the Pacific Ocean lies the Republic of Fiji, a territory made up of 333 islands and a past that links them directly to a mysterious god who had the ability to transform himself into a sea monster. His name was Daku Waka, and the Fijista religion described him as an ordinary man who often looked to the form of a shark to travel throughout the archipelago and punish the enemies of the reefs. Some records that have collected the oral tradition of this cult have managed to specify that, once transformed, Daku Waka became a ferocious creature as big as a megalodon. His mouth was grotesque and his teeth deformed. Nothing could pierce his skin and he often lost all human traits, which led him to commit massacres so bloodthirsty that they were never forgotten. Such was the terror aroused by this creature that the oceans were never the same again. Although the native fishermen and sailors worshipped and venerated it, they lived in fear of what might happen, especially if they saw a dark shadow sailing on the ocean. Those who crossed the path of this transformed god never returned home and for centuries it was one of the most feared creatures on the 333 islands that now make up the Republic of Fiji. Of course, there's no way to blame the natives for the panic they experienced. The ocean is a terrifying place where so many chilling stories about that many consider the best option is to stay as far away from its waters as possible. However, you who are brave and fearless, dare to join us on a new journey through the ocean depths. Follow us to the place from which no traveler returns and you'll know the horrors of the darkness of the ocean. Are you ready? 3, 2, 1. Here are the videos. <laughs>